He spent half his life as a menace, a founder of one of the most violent street gangs on the planet. He, he really, really was ominous. Uh, street robberies, burglaries, definitely drive-by shootings, just wanton violence. Tookie shot him in the back and then shot him again as he fell down and killed him. He had that, that thing and he had anger in him. He spent the other half as an anti-gang activist and author of children's books, a vowed reformer so beloved that Hollywood told his story. After Tookie went through this transformation process, he was ready to start putting out messages of peace. That brother has the answers to bring peace in our streets. Stanley Williams was very passionate about ending gang violence. He's trying to give back so nobody won't follow in his footsteps. He's just trying to do the right thing. The eight book series that Took published became so popular, it eventually earned him a Nobel Peace Prize nomination. So who was the real Tookie Williams? And how much of his brutality should be forgiven? You got to give him a little credit for that. This guy just did something. Shouldn't he get some consideration? He looked into himself. He found that inner peace within himself. So now I'm redeemed. You know, don't, don't kill me. Stanley Tookie Williams on Celebrity Crime Files.